We now have a new drawing available for this particular video in the chapter about external references. So you'll notice we have a host drawing.dwg file. You can see the name at the top of the screen. All I've done is I've actually named the unnamed file from the previous video and I've called it host drawing.dwg. So instead of drawing two or drawing three or drawing four or whatever, it's now actually got a physical name and it's been renamed as host drawing. What we've also got there is the external references drawing here, which you can see on the tabs, has been referenced into the host drawing. As you can see, if I just click on it there like that, it's all one object and you can see it's a reference and the external reference tab kicks in on the ribbon there like so. I'll just hit escape now to deselect it. So what we're going to look at now is updating reference paths. So what happens now if, for example, I do a save as and save my host drawing as a different drawing somewhere else? Obviously, by default, AutoCAD 2018 has what they call a relative path type for external reference files. So ideally, your reference file that you're referencing into your host drawing should be in the same folder as the host drawing itself. But what happens if you change that? Will AutoCAD prompt you and tell you that you need to make a change? Well, let's test that theory and see what happens. What I'll do now is I'll go up to Save As, like so. And you can see there's our two drawings in our external references folder, which is where all the work's going on. What happens now if I save my host drawing perhaps to, say, my desktop, my Windows desktop, like that? So I'm saving it literally to my desktop. If I click Save now, you'll notice that AutoCAD 2018 prompts me. And it's saying now that the current drawing was saved to a different location. Do you want to update the references with relative paths? So you can see there, if the relative paths are not updated, the reference files may not be found the next time the drawing is opened. So obviously, ideally, the recommended option there is to update your relative paths. You don't have to update the paths. You've got the option there as well. You'll also notice you've got a little tick box there saying always perform my current choice. Be careful with that one because as soon as you tick it, it'll always do the choice you select above with the two little blue arrows there. I always leave that unticked just in case I don't want to update my paths. So what I would do there is if I was saving this to my desktop now, I would update the relative paths and everything gets updated with any external reference files that are linked to the drawing that is called hostdrawing.dwg.